Hello, Leo. It's my lady, and this is my lady's way tarot. And I'm coming to do your weekly express love reading for the week of hmm, December 5th through the 12th, 2022. The cards I'm using today are Wisdom of the House of Night by PC Cass. And I'm closing off with The Gothic Tarot by Joseph Virgo. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. All right, more foes. Let's get this show on the road. All right, what's going on with the Leo? Leo, Leo, Leo. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right, so we got the complicated card reversed here. So what it looks like is somebody's trying to make something seem to be complicated when it really is not, okay? Really not. Mm-hmm. All right, so we got the floodling card here. So I do feel this card is about learning new things, okay? Learning new things, getting into new places, learning, learning new people, okay? Mm-hmm. All right, so we got the denial card here. Okay, so definitely somebody is believing that something or someone they're dealing with is not able to change the way that they are doing things, okay? Learn new ways of doing things. Um, and I do feel like it's denial, okay? Because, I mean, that's what the cards are saying. Somebody's in denial about um, what what a relationship they're in is is um doing like what is what's going on here what's going on here okay so i do feel like somebody got a mad strong amount of loyalty to this person and to people okay and i do feel like it's like i'm willing and able to learn and i feel like why this person can't do the same thing, okay? And it, I keep seeing that complicated card reversed here, and it is like somebody is making things more complicated than what they are, okay? Somebody is saying things are complicated, and they really are not, okay? All right, so we got the high priestess of fire here. So I do feel like in this situation, there's a lot of passion. Um, I do feel like a lot of... Um, care and i do feel like it's crazy i'm like love like okay so it's like somebody's on the borderline of loving someone um but i also feel like maybe that's just it you know it's just the passion for some of us and i do feel like it could be just another fire sign okay but let's keep going or this could be you. It's just like you're passionate about everything you're doing. You're passionate about um, all the people that you deal with. And I do feel like the passion in you for this person to learn new things and, and be a better person with this fledgling is, is causing denial. Okay? It's causing that denial. Mm-hmm. Sorry, they um building the uh, uh extension to their house, or I don't know what you call it. So it's been a lot of noise all week, so I'm apologizing. Now I should have said something at the beginning, but now they just start like sawing something. So sorry. Okay. All right. So now we got the high priestess of spirits. So this makes me feel like you got dreams, you have people, you have like little messages, ancestors coming to you giving you all these messages about what to do and how to do it, okay? Um, but, of course, it's on you to listen to what's going on, what they're saying, okay? It's on you. Mm -hmm. But they're all around you, and, of course, I know they're protecting you as well. Um, but, <clears throat> excuse me, but it's on you, okay? It's on you, but what you want to do? Mm hmm All those secrets you're thinking, feeling, knowing, it's inside of you, but the denial is covering it up. All right, so we got the Cycles card here. Oh, wow. So when I saw this Cycles card, I heard your own, okay? 
Uh, so I do feel like somebody's going through their own cycles and this is what's making um, them accept this stuff that's going on, okay? Um, this makes me feel like this is not a first time. This is a reoccurring thing. And what I'm sort of seeing here is somebody is seeing things in people that are not there, are not there. OK, and it's because it's like, I know you can be a good person. You can't see that that person is that person and messages are coming all around about this. Uh, but that care and that passion and that love that you have for that person is clouding your 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 view. OK, so we got the differences card. So I do feel like there are some social differences going on here. Wow. This is helping your denial. OK, those differences in um, social race, religion, you know, all that good stuff, economic status, all that or some of that. OK, um, could be looks, could be it could be anything. OK, but that is the baseline of the denial. Um, I do feel like that person is using that reason for denial. And I do feel like you are accepting that reason because of the differences okay so yes these cards i'm using um the ooh, okay that's express reading because so i'm only gonna pull three so uh the gothic tarot by joseph virago okay let's see what's going on with the leo sorry i'm still not sure about that man siri be sneaking Okay, so like, don't ever say nothing crazy in front of Siri uh, because she will tell on you. Okay, let me just say that. Let's keep going. All right, what's going on with the Virgo? Ooh, about to fall out my hands. Virgo, Virgo, Virgo. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Hold on, we might not ever touch this one. Hold on. All these are supposed to be upright. So I'm going to flip them up, right? All right. Goodness. Okay. So it looks like somebody getting ready to go on some kind of new start, new beginning, okay? I do feel like somebody's going to do a lot of stumbling on this um, path. Uh, but I do feel like it's just going to end up the same way. Um, and I also feel like I'm hearing legal. So somebody might end up in some kind of legal binding or legal, legal trouble um, connected to this situation. So be careful with that, okay? What is going on? Now, all these cards is upside down. Oh, I can't. I can't. Siri did it. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. All right. What is going on? So we got the temperance card reversed here. So somebody could be dealing with a Sagittarius. Like I said, it could be other fire sign energy. Aries Leo Sag. Um, but I also feel like somebody feel, feels and sees that everything is off balance and they're starting to get angry about the situation. Okay. I'm starting to get mad. And this even came upside down. But we're going to fix all these at the end. So we got the Ten of Wands reversed here. So I do feel like somebody was working hard to make things work to push to the end of this situation. But I feel like, of course, it's not working and somebody's giving up, okay? Not, so, not only is this person giving up, but I feel like I'm extremely angry, like spine-chilling angry, okay, about what has been done by this person to me, okay? All right, so we have the four pinnacles here. So like I said, I was feeling a legal binding, a legal binding. Somebody was legally binded to a situation. And with this legal binding, I feel like oh, I feel like I'm sort of stuck here. Okay. Or this person is feeling like they're stuck there because of that legal binding. Okay. All right, so we have the Three of Wands reversed here. 
So I do feel like, yeah, with this situation, I do feel like somebody is wanting this person to come and, and you know, do the right thing and do what, you know, you feel like is right for them. But I feel like, of course, it's not going to happen. They're not going to do it. I do feel like there's a third party situation mixed up all in this. And I feel like, you know, they just don't want to control it. It's not that they can't control it. This is that they don't want to. Okay, they don't want to. They just trying to make it seem like it's harder than what it is. All right, so now we got the death card. So definitely some changes are getting ready to come to this situation and endings are happening as well, okay? Um, so endings, new beginnings. So I do feel like this cycle is getting ready to be over and I do feel like um, somebody's gonna start something else, okay? But also this passion card, Ten of Wands reversed, okay? So, of course, I don't like saying this, but for some of us, I do feel like you're getting ready to find someone has a slow terminal um, disease, okay? Uh, yeah, I do feel like whatever this is, it took a long time to get there. Of course, this is not for everybody, um, but I do feel like, yeah, they might not be able to make it if they don't get it checked out soon okay all right for the rest of us i do feel like emotionally somebody is getting ready to turn off completely it's just like i've tried and tried and tried um, relationships i've tried to put my emotions and care into situations and and it just hasn't ever worked and now i'm just getting ready i'm shutting it all off i'm just getting ready to start having some fun okay sometimes we got to let go and have some fun and that's when what you really want falls into your lap, okay? But that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.